also, um, based on a lot of comments I got, everybody wanted me to, well not everybody, but a lot of people wanted me to try, um, a soft-spoken video. So, that's what I'm doing. Um, it feels really weird. I feel like I'm being way too loud, but I will rewatch like, probably five seconds of it before I get too grossed out by my own voice and then I'll post it. So, yeah. Um, I have like four sketchbooks. Um, three of them are actually my boyfriend's. Only one of them is mine. Uh, I have like two more, but they're put away in storage right now and I didn't really want to go and get them out. So, yeah. Um, I'll start with one of his. I also have this little thing. It's like, uh, I think it is supposed to like be for blending or shading or whatever. But I'm going to use it to trace and point at stuff. Okay. So this is my boyfriend's sketchbook. I got this for him June 16th, 2022. So it's an older one. Don't even know. Yeah, he hasn't even finished it yet. <laughs> but I guess I'll just start going through them. Um... I had a couple comments when I brought up the idea of doing this video, say they wanted me to like explain the drawings in detail, um, which I can do with some of them, but I'm not gonna lie, a lot of my boyfriend's drawings I don't understand. They're really cool, but I just don't really understand. Um, and a lot of them are also nightmare fuel, so maybe just listen to this video and don't watch it. <laughs> okay, so here's this, well, a little bat, and then... Here's his first drawing. I think it's supposed to be of, um, X, but I'm not- I think so. But I'm not sure. Here he has a drawing of a shoe. When I see this shoe, I can only think of it being white gray and like neon green or like yellow. I don't know. It's the only colors I could see it possibly being. I feel like I'm being so loud. Okay. Here he has a dragon guy. He's got cool wings. I like his little claws. I feel like he did pretty good at that. Also, um, don't sue because <laughs> we both find, like, all of our drawing ideas off Pinterest, or a good majority of them. Um, so if you've seen any of these, like, on Google or Pinterest, that's probably why. <laughs> okay, but, um, I drew this little guy here. And the ghost. These are kind of just, he has little, like, sketches around sometimes. But, um... This guy, it's like a demon devil thing. I don't know. Like I said, a lot of my boyfriend's drawings I couldn't really explain in detail. Here is a little bee. And then the name of a song I listen to. But a little bee. He also writes out a lot of song lyrics and names. A lot. Um, here's a little guy with a ski mask on. I don't really know what his plans are. They don't look very good though. And then we got this guy. I think he's from the movie. Am I wrong about- is he from The Incredibles? Am I wrong about that? Let me know. But yeah, there's this guy. Also, um, it's currently getting kind of loud because, um, there's some arguing going in the room across from me. So, if you hear that, I'm sorry. Okay. God, I feel like I don't like this video already. This one is a little bit harder to see. It's an unfinished one, by the looks of it. I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not. It's just like a heart with some wings. He started adding a face to it. 
but I think he gave up on this one. the little cheetah guy and it has a little sun behind it. I feel like he did pretty good at the shading on it. Here's a rose flower that he drew. He also painted that flower up there with the eyeball. You can't see it that well. And those purple, I mean purple, blue flowers right there, he painted as well. And that my rose, that also looks like he never finished the shading on, but it still looks great. And then a drawing he started of our dog and never finished. Very cute. I could just finish it playing right now, but <laughs> it wouldn't look as good. So this is what I meant by, he has a lot of little pages that are just little sketches all around it. But yeah, he doesn't normally, this is his um, pencil sketchbook, he doesn't normally um, draw with pencil, he usually uses pen. So this whole drawing style is a bit different than even what he he would usually do, but he has a little guy up there, some eyeballs, and a little guy, some lyrics from a little peep song, and then on this page, on this page, we got this guy right here that I like a lot, and this guy who looks like he has bad intentions. I mean, I guess technically they- honestly, no, I would- I don't know, I would hang out with this guy. He seems chill. But, um, yeah. This video is gonna end up so long if I don't go a little bit faster. Have you ever seen this show? Oh my god, they're yelling so loud. I hope you don't hear that as much as I do. Okay. But anyways, have you ever seen this show? With the sad horse, Bojack? If you haven't, don't. Um, it'll ruin your life. And then he did this tiny thing of my name right here. He t sometimes he draws little things like that, and it's so cute. And then this guy, um, I don't remember what those masks are for. I think it's for chemicals. Now there's a freaking ambulance. Okay. Okay, I think that was the end of his sketchbook. Um, I'm gonna go through another one of his before I go through mine. Setting the setting the standards pretty high here, guys. You're gonna be listening to all these, looking at all these great drawings, and then you're gonna see mine. It's okay. Um, he just the other day drew this on the front of his sketchbook. I just bought him this one recently. I always keep him stocked on his walls. <laughs> but this is one that I think it's pencil and pen. I'm not sure. Yeah, I believe it is, but it's probably gonna be mostly pen because that's usually what his medium is but oh also i might have already shown some of these drawings in um a different video but yeah so here's the first page i really thought these guys were supposed to be like connected and like there's a fish on one end there's this guy on the other no it's just two separate drawings that i guess look like they collided you can see the next drawing to the paper but then you got this little bird guy right here little fish, the koi fish. I love these fish, they're so pretty. Here's a pair of eyeballs. He 
wasn't lying when he told me he can't draw eyebrows for shit. Wow. Sorry, babe, but wow. <laughs> that was so mean. He knows I love him. But yeah, um, here's some eyeballs. another one of his little sketchy pages that he did. This is my favorite drawing on there. Even though he obviously wasn't a fan. Oh, here's another cool one on there, too. Oprah one, right there. That's cool. He likes to... <clears throat> he likes to draw a lot of skulls. These pages are just like ones that um weren't finished and things like that, so I'm just skipping over some of them. This is one of my favorite pages in this whole sketchbook. I love that guy right there. And then here's this guy. I don't know for sure that it's who he was trying to draw, but doesn't he look like a Miles from Into the Spider-Verse. And then... Oh my gosh, I don't know if you can read that. But it's so cute. This guy says, right here, he says, Are you scared? And this guy back says, Of course, but I know everything ev will eventually be okay. And that's so cute. That's not even what it says, because I can't read, but... It says, Of course, but I know it will eventually all be okay. And that's so cute to me. And then we got this little guy right here with all the eyeballs. He's drawn that a couple times. That bird guy from that one uh, video that everybody sees on uh, how drugs make you feel. Don't do drugs. This page is not appropriate to show you. And then this page is really super cool too. We got this guy right here. Looks like his face just freaking exploded. Pretty cool. And then we got this guy. Oh, the lighting though. This guy right here. This is what a lot of the dudes y'all girls be going for the look of this. And then we got this guy right here, who for some reason finally got his third eye open and then that happened. Sorry. Okay. I'm gonna show you guys a couple more from the sketchbook and then I'm gonna move on to mine. Um, I might not um, go through this last one just because this video is getting pretty long and my boyfriend's just in the shower right now. I'm just filming a video while he's in the shower. So yeah, um, I don't want him to walk in and I have to restart. I don't have, okay, I can cut like from the beginning and the end of a video, but I can't cut parts out of it. Do you guys have suggestions that don't cost money that I can do that on? But here's a guy that he drew that that was pretty cool like a wolf or something. I don't like explaining his drawings, so I don't want to explain it wrong because I feel like I'm being offensive towards his art, but I think it's like a wolf guy, and then it's got like human arms, and I thought that was pretty cool. This is one of the ones he did in pencil in here. Here's one that he colored in of a monarch butterfly. I thought that was pretty cool as well. Last summer, um, we raised, I think it was 40-something monarch caterpillars up until they were butterflies. A little lamb. I love this lamb. The shading on him is just amazing. He did a great job at that. got 
this little guy right here and then a couple other little faces around okay but seriously i need to speed this up some scrolls um <clears throat> the references for these were was an actual coyote scroll that he found in the woods while he was visiting his mom i thought that was pretty cool some hands because he's been working on um, drawing hands more. I really like that. This wolf guy with crazy eyes. Stretch out. I think it's cute how his ears are back like that. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys one more and then I'm gonna move on to the other. I am so sorry about the yelling. I know you guys have to be able to hear some of it at least. But here's the last drawing. I mean, obviously not the last one in his sketchbook, but it's the last one I'm gonna show you guys. I feel like I'm literally embarrassing myself by showing you guys his first because I'm setting such a high standard and then I'm just showing you guys mine and it's just like ruin but here's my sketchbook um I don't have a lot of drawings in here because I just recently <coughs> sorry um I just recently started drawing again so I don't have too much art in here because when I was drawing I used my larger sketchbook that I'm in storage right now. But let's get to the first page. Okay, so the first page I have is just this little book. It's got some butterflies coming out of it. It's got some stars. It's really simple. Mine are going to be a lot easier to explain than his. This is just bullshit. Don't look at that. Um, but yeah, this is a little book. I'm not too proud of this drawing. Especially that star. That star literally ruins it all. Don't tell me it doesn't. It does. Next page. I got this little mushroom guy right here. And he's behind this tree. I didn't really do any shading in this. I should probably go back and finish this drawing. But I think he's cute. Just a little mushroom guy. I have actual beef with this because it didn't turn out the way I wanted it to, literally whatsoever, um, but it's fine. And then I have this, kind of just like a sketch page that I did. Um, uh, this one had something under it and then I messed it up so I just did a big black blob over it and I tried to make it look the best I could. Um, peace on hand, some flowers. Uh, Magnolia lyrics and an eyeball. Um, on this page, a few pages, um, I did a lot of flowers. This I was trying to draw a person and it didn't work out, so I just kind of covered it with flowers. <laughs> and literally, the only thing I didn't cover over with pen is this. I really like that flower. I think it's cute. I like this one too. Okay. Um, this next one, I was just starting to learn how to shade with um, paint markers. I feel like I did a decent job. The original plan was to copy Pinterest and do the cherries and then take blue and outline them with blue. And then halfway through, I was like, man, I feel like this would look cuter. So I did this, and I do like the way it turned out. Okay. 
so this next page, um, I also have beef with these jellyfish. I hate them so much. I actually hate them so much, but it's okay. Um, I do like these eyeball guys. They look hypnotized. Um, I should have done a better job on the eyelashes, but that's okay. And then I have the yelling is so loud. There's no way you don't hear this. Not be able to upload this video. Okay. Um, I have this eyeball. It's like an anime one. It's not supposed to be realistic. And then I got a little uh, safety pin with some hearts on it. Um, this is a little eyeball with some mushrooms growing at the top and the bottom. There's one, two, three, four, five, six at the top. Six at the bottom. And then there's this page with all of these eyeballs and some squiggles. Got squiggles everywhere. And then we got one, two, three, four eyeballs. If you count the pupils, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. I can count. I graduated a year early for your information. That sounded so snobby. Don't judge me. Okay. Um, I got these flowers that I did. Um, I initially just wanted to do a couple of these. And then I got bored of doing that flower, like, the minute I was done, all these little circles were actual hell to do, so I was like, yeah, I'm not doing that again. And I just finished it off with some cool shapes and another little plant right there. I'm still trying to decide if I should color these shapes in with the gray. This, you can't really tell, but it has little polka dots in there. Um, <clears throat> I literally have beef with, like, these two faces so hard. But I got a face there, and I got a face there that I was drawing in pen, and then I was working on a collage as well. And then right here I have an eyeball, and right here I have a not as good eyeball. I really like this one though, I like the way it turned out. And then you can't see the whole eyebrow, that's okay. Here's some more faces I was working on, guys. Guys, I... <laughs> I just started working on faces, so they're really not good. And I've learned um, that I'm do I do a lot better in pen than I do in pencil. But, um, here's another face I tried to draw, and then I started two others and just didn't like the way the head shape turned out. And I'm pretty sure that is the end of my sketchbook. I guess, just to pass the time, I will show a couple drawings out of this one, out of Tyler's other one, my boyfriend's other one. There's this little Pac-Man dude, and Ghost, and right here, I can hear that he's out of the shower, so I'm gonna finish this up. Here's another Bojack drawing, and the skull. Here's another Bojack drawing. When I tell you guys, we've been watching Bojack on repeat for, I think, nine or ten months now. Every time it ends, we just restart it. I've seen it over 200 times. <laughs> this is a little ghost main character. Um, some cool little sketches. There's a rat guy. And a few other little sketches. Oh, I really like this. 
here's a drawing of a face he did. Some little things. There's a few other ones he did. I love this guy. It's like a deer. What does that say? Wendigo. This little guy is cool. show you two more drawings and then I'm gonna say bye. So I have this guy right here and then another skull. Like I said guys he draws a lot of skulls. And then show you guys one more. Um is it really bad that I oh the Grim Reaper right? Oh my gosh. My brain is everywhere right now. That is about it, guys. I hope you enjoyed my first soft-spoken video. Um, let me know if you want more, so like more like these. I probably won't just start doing my videos soft-spoken every time because I do um enjoy whispering videos better myself, and my throat gets kind of like crappy when I try to do soft-spoken videos. But um, I definitely be down to do more if that's what you guys are interested in. So just let me know. Um, and have a great day.